Hello, I'm Senator Maggie Hassan. I want to thank the New Hampshire Veterans Home for holding this Patriots Day ceremony to mark the anniversary of the attacks on our country that took place on September 11th, 2001. 20 years ago, acts of terrorism forever changed this nation. September 11th was one of the darkest days in our history. And it's hard to believe that it's been 20 years. But no matter how long it's been, we must always come together to remember the innocent victims who we lost. We also have to remember their families and their loved ones. And we remember and honor those who put their lives on the line to protect people who they had never met. Our first responders, our service members, and ordinary citizens. And today we also remember those who served and made the ultimate sacrifice in the war on terrorism. Following 9-11, our country went to war in Afghanistan. And I know that the situation there over the last several weeks has taken an especially tough toll on our Afghanistan veterans and their families. It underscores the importance of ensuring that veterans have the support that they need and that they have earned. I serve on the Veterans Affairs Committee and on the Homeland Security Committee, which was formed in the wake of 9-11. And in these roles, I'll continue to work to support our veterans and to keep our country safe, secure, and free. Americans demonstrated their collective resilience on 9-11 and in its aftermath. We were strong and brave for one another, and we united and persevered. As we take time to reflect on this day, it's a good time to think about the bonds that we share, recognizing the strength and promise of our remarkable country and rededicating ourselves to the concept of freedom that is at our very core. Thank you again to the New Hampshire Veterans Home for hosting this ceremony and to all of the veterans here for your service on behalf of all of us. God bless New Hampshire and the United States of America and Godspeed everyone.